I welcome all of you on behalf of Hyderabad, on behalf of Telangana State, to BioAsia 2024. Today, in post-COVID era, people are looking at life, health and disease. And therefore, BioAsia, differently. They have both fear and hope in their eyes. The hope is because of Hyderabad is the undisputed life sciences capital of India and perhaps world. We make, in, we make one in three vaccines made in the world. In last 20 years, BioAsia helped Hyderabad achieve this status. This conference helped position India and Asia specific as a focal point in life sciences. COVID has proved that our problems, at least in healthcare, are safe. And we must find solutions together. As I said, there is both anxiety and hope. If COVID was a fear, this year's theme, data and artificial intelligence is both. Thankfully, Hyderabad is also a capital of IT and software research and startups. My government is committed to create the perfect ecosystem that includes policy, infrastructure, infrastructure and support. Both domestic and international companies are startups. I must confess my focus to drive growth of MSMEs, which are a bridge between the startups and big corporate companies corporations. Recently I met representatives from pharma sector to understand their challenges. I promise to support them in a way we can. You dream to you dream is to reach the sky. We will ensure a rocket to take you there is ready. We in Congress know the value of trust. I am announcing here to establish next phase of Genome Valley in 300 acres of land with 2,000 crores investment. We recently announced launch of 10 pharma villages with an investment of about 1 lakh crore. This will develop infrastructure, create jobs, create opportunities for entrepreneurs, we will create over 5 lakh new jobs. At this village, three potential integrated greenfield pharma we have been identified. One is from Vikarabad district, the other one is from Medak district, third one is from Nalgonda district. We are going to create a pharma village all the three areas, three different parts of Telangana, it's nearby Hyderabad airport, hardly one, one and a half hour drive from international airport. So to reach your infrastructure and your investment. At the recently concluded World Economic Forum in Davos, we got, as my industries and uh, IT minister said, 40,232 crore investment in my state. And I am delighted to share that Takeda has decided to set up their manufacturing facility in Hyderabad in partnership with Biological E. I am most welcoming the, the investment. This facility will make 50 million doses of vaccines each year. As I said, in a world where a virus can create fear, Hyderabad gives hope. I'm happy to share all of you. The German company, Miltani, has decided to set up their R&D center in Hyderabad. I'm welcoming the R&D center. Finally, it's my delightful duty to congratulate Professor Greg Semenza, Nobel Prize winner, on being named winner of the Genome Valley Excellence Award. I once again welcome all of you. 
have a successful conference with wonderful experience and find great success. Together, we will shape a healthier tomorrow for all of humanity. Thank you. Thank you, Anna.